Hi. Thank you for watching this video. If you like this video, don't forget to subscribe. In this video, we will talk about how to make a simple static website or edit a simple static website using a pre-designed template and how to register a domain, how to host a website and how to add your website to search engine optimization in Google. And first you have to download this file from learn it easy file from description after downloading that you can just find this and extract this file to your folder using winzip or winrar and just open the index html in your browser you can just open this with a microsoft edge and just place into one of your screen side and next open the other file index html dot docx in your wordpad now you can see a uh, uh, text is uh, marked as red color and and corresponding um, text from your browser that means you can edit that specific red color document and get your uh, desired criteria but you want to see in website that uh, highlighted in red color if you want to change that you can just go for uh, in the scroll down the other it is uh, if you're just editing that if you can really want to add your three <coughs> whatever is your uh, website's name and you can just edit by um, comparing these two you can easily make the website if you want to uh, in place of electrical you want something else you can just edit in here you can edit anything in that in here you can just comparing these two you can just easily make an static website just go for uh, and if you want to add any URL to your images, uh, that means I just add a hyperlink to this image. I want to show an YouTube. I just want to redirect that into a YouTube account. You can just see here. Uh, this direct into YouTube. Just taking back. You can just add uh, the whatever you want the URL, or uh, you can add. Anything you can just compare this to with you can add anything that you want you have to just edit the red color text only this highlighted what are the textures and if you want to change the images you can just go to this folder and save the images exactly on that name you can just replace the image with same name please note that the dimension of this image should be the same for the better viewing of the websites you can just compare these two images you can try I used the uh, same images everywhere and save that file and just close that's all about what I want to do there now just open the index HTML doc in WordPad again and save as that into a document file. This simple text file as index HTML. We need to remove that docs and let's save and close everything. And you can see here index and you can just open that
now your website is ready if you change any of the images or content you will see the exactly uh, the same that you made it the differences or a uh, image will be changed and you can add this into win zip file don't use winrar file winrar file will never detected by the server only win zip file use win zip file and you can name it whatever you want it this for your you can save Okay, I just saved it on the desktop as you can see here. Okay, that's all what I wanted to do with the website. Now, the designing of the website is done. That's all how to make an website uh, static website using pre-designed template now we should look into how to register a domain for our website for that I'm gonna use godaddy.com it's a famous um, domain registration website you can just go to Google and it's gonna appear like this I'm gonna type here uh, type the for my web website name for you can type whatever you want to do I'm gonna type no for easy.com <coughs> let's check it's available or not um, the website shows it's available no for easy.com your domain is available I'm gonna add that into card and wait for Data. Now it's added to my card. I'm gonna continue with my card for my pay checkout or my payment. Here you can watch the my payment details. I'm gonna just select for one year. Now you can just see all the if you have an if you have an uh, credit card you can just pay uh, only 127 to 0.65 rupees uh, you can see uh, proceed i have an account right now if you don't have any account you can go for create an account so i'm um, going to sign into my account Is showing how to pay uh, um, by see here credit card or prepaid card you can only buy this with credit card or prepaid card if you don't have any credit card just go to back and you can remove this the promotion code This for now. So if you uh, if you don't have any credit card, you have to pay seven not two rupees. Uh, that means you don't get any offer from their side. Okay, then proceed to check out. Just gonna log into your account. Here you can see net banking, credit card, prepaid card. You can just use your credit card to buy the domain. That's all. After you paying, you will go direct to your account so after uh, finishing your payment after logging into your uh, godaddy.com account and you can go here to manage your domain you can go here manage my domain And you can see a setting bar here manage DNS after scrolling down you can see name servers this is what you gonna uh, uh, connect your domain to your server that means your hosting server 
we gonna discuss this later after discussing how to make a hosting account or a server next step is to register your hosting account for that I'm gonna use here freehosting.com it's an free service so let's get started you can just see the uh, main window you can go you can just go for get started this and uh, free hosting and paid hosting I'm gonna select free hosting you can just type the uh, domain that you previously uh, selected I'm gonna type now for ec.com and I'm not gonna add anything for uh, uh, money I'm just gonna continue with add to cart and check out for zero zero USD here you can type your details whatever they are asking for after filling this you can just mm, tick that and mm, click on complete order it will get saved and this will get saved and it's all in here after your email verification that you got in your mail id you can just go for membership area you can type me email id and password you can just log in to the window here you can go for services and my services you can see here your website uh, it take a couple of uh, minutes uh, 10 to 20 minutes to get activated the status after getting activated after getting activated you will get a mail from uh, uh, freehosting.com on that mail they will specify the name server you can just copy that and we'll go for here that we discussed earlier you can just click on change and custom you can just paste that in here whatever they ask for and click save that's all about uh, that's all you want to do with uh, 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 your godaddy.com now after continuing all of this you will have specified something on your mail called cpanel cpanel.freehosting you will get a link on that you can just log into uh, this as specified that on the mail After getting login, you can just go to file manager. Public HTML. And you can just upload the file that we made it earlier in zip format. just see here that uploading after 100 percentage completed you can just click go back you can just see it here and update it and after right clicking on that you can just click extract extract files
just extract the files into this folder so let's go to extractor after uh, 20 to 30 minutes you can just type here your web address just type here your web address and it will show up like this Now we made it a website and hosted it and now it's working we just checked out. Now how to make the website appear on the search engine. For that, that uh, that's also called search engine optimization SEO. For that I need to log into Google account. Logging into your Google account you can just type submit url you can just type submit url to google i'm showing him and submit submit url google you can just go for it you can just type your url whatever it is www dot now for easy dot com you can just verify you can just verify and just submit request and you can see here your request has been received and will be processed shortly so and you can search in google you can just find your website Okay, thank you for watching this video. If you like this video, don't forget to subscribe. Let's see you on next video. Thank you. Bye bye.